I wanted to start this video off with an explanation of why Hamster Thursday is actually Harbor Seal Thursday this week, but then I found myself with footage of our boy Hiro Ashibe there screaming at a hamburger. Cannot, cannot, cannot make this up. But let's back up a bit. The hamsters are still on vacation. I think they're laid over at O'Hare Airport. And so it's Harbor Seal Thursday featuring our favorite adorable Harbor Seal pup, Gonchan. Though unlike his Super Famicom outing, where he platformed his way, adorably, through an amusement park, this time he's, um, serving as the damage gauge for a very strange, super minimalist RPG in an amusement park that features a boy screaming at hamburgers. Let's try this again. Ashibe gets a letter from his grandpa inviting him to a recently opened amusement park, and if there's one thing we've learned, it's that this tends to end badly for all involved. There are in fact five parks, and they all contain... um... horrible food products attempting to impede your progress. And you thought Vanillite was bad. I've hit two different ice creams, popsicles, cups, that burger we saw earlier, and... I've got no idea what this is, maybe a bean of some kind? Anyway. Ashibe and his two teammates, which change depending on which park you're presently raiding, take the RPG action down to its bare essentials. You got an attack command, a heal command, and a run the hell away command if you just don't want those empty calories in your diet today. Their attacks, all functionally similar, range from shouting to, um, conspicuously not shouting and just ellipsis-ing at the mob like Squall, to this shampoo wannabe beaning a creepy looking clown with a walk. However, you don't get numbers to tell you how effective the attack was, you get, well, no indication whatsoever. If you take damage, you don't lose HP, Gonchan's picture down there just gets more distressed. That's it, no numbers, just pictures of seals. Harbor Seal Thursday, folks. Thing is, while I'm not generally opposed to stripped back interpretations of RPGs, they're rather prone to the pitfalls of the genre, like, Encounter Rate. You know those Zubat and Mount Moon? That place will look like a damn ghost town compared to how bad the Encounter Rate gets here. You think there'd be some kind of litter crew equipped with, I don't know, signs or something to take care of this mess, being that it is, after all, an amusement park. Also, rather than using any healing items whatsoever, you've... Uh, you got a seal. His cuteness and adorable proclamations of QQ are apparently enough to reinvigorate any member of your party whose health gauges you might remember are the self-same seal's face. There appears to be no limit to how much you can do this. This isn't a game then, really, as there's no resource management outside of remember to heal. What it is, is, um... Hey, remember when that kid yelled at a hamburger while a confused seal looked on? I remember that. Our special thanks, as always, go to friend of all mammals, aquatic and otherwise, Felicity in Worcestershire. This is the end of the show!